There's good people in this world. We see a lot of negativity through news and social media, but there are good people out there doing good things, and I'm a witness to that every single day. When I started volunteering, I was a little concerned about, I, if I'm going to start this, I want to be able to do it on a regular basis. It became evident to my friends, to my family, if you're looking for Henry on Tuesday, he'll be at the VA hospital. Well, I hope you're able to go home today. I volunteer a lot, and I greet a lot of veterans when they come in. The veterans that I volunteer with are in the hospice, so they're going through the um, final stages of life. And it means a lot to me to be able to give back to them at this time. Sometimes we have veteran dances, like for Valentine's, Halloween. I never stop volunteering. I've been coming all the time. Just feel an special emotion and uh, a special feeling, you know, that I know that I'm coming to make a difference. Some of these veterans haven't had hugs or someone just to talk to, an ear, in a long time. The most surprising aspect of volunteering in the VA, at least for me as a hospice volunteer, has been how bright and happy the hospice actually is. A large number of the veterans there have quite a sense of humor. I kept noticing every time when I would leave to come home, I thought, you know, I feel better than I did when I got there. They give it back to me. Hello, it's so wonderful to see you today. My passion is with our homeless veterans um, because a lot of times if you look right, walk right, talk right, smell right, people are, are very apt to help you. But if you're down on your luck and sleeping in the street, people may not be as quick to um, offer assistance. Those people have names. Their eyes are warm. They have stories that um, that match mine in some ways. I'm very blessed to have done the things um, that I did and come back and still be able to not have um, some of the scars that some of the men and women served with me. And for me, it's a passion, it's a calling. It really is enjoyable to give out love. It becomes part of my routine. It's part of what I do now. I want to do what I can to make sure that those veterans spend the rest of their life having the best life that they can.